No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait. Oh my god, why am I so ugly? I'm literally ugly. When people leave me nasty comments saying my hair looks disgusting, I get it. Hi sisters, James Charles here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today's video is already off to a bad start because I'm feeling ugly today. Uh, but it's gonna get even worse because today's video we are filming probably 100% actually, my least favorite video to film. However, it is your guys' favorite video to watch. Today we are continuing on our lovely journey of exposing the absolute ridiculous buffoonery scamming that is five minute crafts makeup hacks. Let's get into it. I really hope that you guys are excited for this new episode of testing out five minute craft makeup hacks. And if you are, please give it a thumbs up down below because you know that I am not. <laughs> Yeah. I say this every single time and I will clarify once again, okay, I am all down for a makeup hack. I love anything that is going to help you guys make your makeup routine faster, more efficient. You know, that's good. The problem is with five minute crafts makeup hacks, they're all just clickbait videos to get you to watch them so they can make money in their bank account. That looks like So. What, what were they just saying before that? <laughs> oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god! This shit just gets dumber and dumber. She. <laughs> Thanks. Band aids to cover up your eyebrows and your mouth. Pretty smart. <laughs> I beg to differ, actually. What's the point in covering up your eyebrows so no foundation gets in this entire area if you're then just gonna go in with a brush and fix it after the fact? I wish my band aids could take off. What if you ever ripped off a band-aid and it actually takes body hair with you? Does it really? Actually, I get late. Oh, I realize I have literally just been thinking, mine never takes off any hair. That's because I have none. Oh, this is my favorite one. Uh, incredible. <laughs> Alright, you guys, so now that the foundation is all on on the face. Wow, perfect. Oh my God, wow, no way, that is so great. And now I can totally do them because I couldn't before. We just wasted three perfectly good Band-Aids. It's a f***ing flop. No. Do you ever feel old? No. How would I feel old, I'm 22. Do you ever feel old? Yes, all the time. I'm ancient. I just started my will yesterday. Well, this is a good virtual face lift hack with concealer. Oh. Okay. I am old. Same. Okay, concealer below the brow, on the mouth, in the inner corner. Ew, she's literally rubbing this on her face. That is not how you blind this girl. Oh my god, and it cuts to her having a full face of makeup done. This. Some, something happened there. Something happened there and it was not just concealer, Miss Girl. There's either a filter on this video, the surgeon stopped halfway through the surgery, or more than likely, this is actual face tapes. I probably think she actually has face tapes on that is literally giving her face a physical lift because concealer is great. The actual technique that they showed, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I have to give credit where credit is due. I said I would be open to this. That's actually correct. If you do focus your concealer here on the outer corner of your eye and here, it's going to naturally lift your face upwards. <laughs> this this is not concealer, baby girl. This is a doctor. Okay, so I just did like a super, super soft, slight little contour, just so you guys can kind of see the difference, right? Now we're just gonna grab a little bit of my concealer. Just gonna grab some e.l.f. Camo Concealer. I'm gonna leave one side of my face completely normal, and then on the other side of my face, I'm gonna do the whole concealer hack, so you guys can decide whether or not it looks nice and lifted. All right, you guys, so I'm looking straight ahead. Both sides were lightly contoured, but this side has concealer and this one does not. It's obviously not like a crazy groundbreaking hack because this is pretty much what we do for our concealer routine every time that we do our makeup. We definitely can get some subtle improvements when it comes to makeup and contouring, but uh, something like that is gonna cost a few thousand dollars and a good surgeon. Um, this is when you're surrounded by plants and you have a nail malfunction. Mm. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I hate when I go 
adjusting my fur and my fingernail breaks off. No! No! You f***ed! Oh my god! Oh my god! First of all, that looked like she was cutting that with a knife. That is not a scissor. Holy sh! Oh my god. That has to be the worst one that we've ever seen. That takes the cake from the burnt banana, even the broccoli. This is worse than the broccoli! How would you ever break your nail on a plant? Like, for like, why are you manhandling your plants? All you have to do is water them and just judge the leaves. Like, what are you doing? And I just sit there. <laughs> yeah. People, people know what judging means. No, 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 no. The plant gaze can defend me. Look at in this scene how the shape is so busted and wonky and ugly because it's a leaf. She's painting a leaf. And then magically the next cut, one second later, is a full set of acrylic nails that are all way longer than the leaf and gorgeously shaped. As usual, something is not adding up. Small today. <laughs> Actually, no. <laughs> to literally never. So imagine you hadn't gotten lip filler. Uh -huh. Imagine the thought. Okay? okay, yeah, yeah. This is a natural, holistic way to do it. <laughs> oh, holistic. <laughs> oh, massage for plump lips. I love how they had to put in a before and after photo because they knew they couldn't do it on video. They had to fully Photoshop that. Okay, let's do a before and after, ready? He has no lips. How will he get a kiss kiss? Oh my God, I can feel them growing. Let's show that after. Oh, shit. oh my God, so handsome. I think I just popped my filler. You struggle with an ombre lip, don't you? All the time. Well, then, then this will definitely help. That is not disgusting at all. Okay, nice red lipstick on the bottom. Okay, some concealer on top. Oh, around it. I don't know, why would you ever? Oh my God. I can't, I really, okay. Wow, look at how boring and disgusting and lame this red lip looks. I just, it's screaming that it needs an ombre. Beautiful. <laughs> oh my God, literally. <laughs> All I had to do if I wanted an ombre lip so badly, okay, look at this. Sorry, I should have waited and said, look at this once I finished. <laughs> You grab a red lip, just like this one, and you just put one little dot right in the middle, just like that, okay? Super simple, and then you can put your lips together, okay? Now grab your finger and just blend out, just like that. Look at that, that took me three seconds, and you didn't have to go do all those things. These are for all the times that you need falsies, but you're gonna pinch. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, where are my eyelashes? No! You Oh my God! Oh my God! Not cutting off her hair. Eyelash glue. No, you lunatic! Oh my! Somebody needs to shut down this channel. There needs to be a government notice. No way! Recycling. Wow. <laughs> yeah. ah! Oh my god! What do we think, ladies? Yes, yes. <laughs> wow. Oh. From that angle. Honestly, it's kind of giving. <laughs> if somebody gave me like a full set of like human hair lashes that like looked gorgeous, human I'd wear them. Here's another hack for you. Knowing you want to dye your hair, all you have is lipstick. No. Body. 
you know that she finished putting that on her and she thought she ate that. So we have my nice dark brown hair in this gorgeous Morphe purple color. Perfect for a nice just pop of color. It's giving monster high. <laughs> I mean, it did, it's, it, it's, it's yeah. It's there, it's ugly, but it's there. I'm, I'm actually very surprised that it like actually even showed up on my hair. I genuinely thought that it was gonna be nothing. Like the fact that it's actually there is like, Kind of cool. This is the best for last. This is called fashion and function. Oh, that's me, Miss Girl. <laughs> Drilling. Oh, sculpting a nail into a fork. It looks like metallic nail powder. Yep, this is gonna be a fork. Oh, yep. Bouncing into a macaroon. Oh, and now we have a a candle. A candle on the nail. I can't, I can't, I can't. First of all, turning your nail into a fork, eating with your nails, that is maybe the most repulsive thing that I've ever seen. To think about shoving that into food and then eating it is maybe the grossest thing that I thought about all day. Maybe the grossest thing that I thought about all day. All right, and on that note, you guys, I think that is quite enough of these five minute craft makeup hacks for today. You guys, I hate doing these videos more than anything in the entire world because they are such a stupid scam. However, at least we have fun while doing it and get to laugh along the way. I really, really hope that you guys enjoyed this video today. If you did and you enjoyed my torture throughout these videos, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below. Honestly, give this video a thumbs up for the last extension alone. If you have not already, make sure you click that big to subscribe button as well and come join the family as well as that bell icon so you never miss when I upload a new video. If you want to follow me on my other social media platforms, I promise that I usually give some better makeup hacks that you actually might want to incorporate into your everyday life. You can follow me on James Charles. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I love you and I will see you in the next one. Bye.